We're here at Rockley Markets in Brisbane, the best market for Saturdays where we're going to get some fresh veggies, some beautiful flowers and anything else that takes our eye, that catches our eye. You can get really good fish here too. Yeah, awesome fish. <laughs> There's a fantastic spice man here who has all kinds of delicious, fresh herbs and spices. I highly recommend you find someone in your local area because nothing beats good, fresh spices. Or any products that you get from the supermarket tend to sit there for a very long time and they just don't have that kind of vibrancy of fresh flavour, you know what I mean? When you yeah. fry up spices and they're just like... It really comes alive. Yeah. This guy this guy is awesome because he can mix and match any kind of spice mix that you want. And um, and it's literally like the best. He, he knows all of the, the ratios and he knows what's going to taste best. And he's... Because he was, you know, he had his own restaurant for years. He's yeah. actually a chef. Yeah, he's actually a chef, so he knows his stuff. Yeah, exactly. So we're pretty excited about going to see him this morning. We're going to go down here. <laughs> oh my oh, God. Sausage. Oh, Check out that big one. We're getting distracted by sausages. <laughs> they look so good. This place is dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> Yum. Yum. Oh, there he is. Ah, oh, we see him. So we're just going up to the spice guy, see what he's got. This guy makes me happy. Every time I see him, I'm just like... <laughs> so we need some spices for our meals tomorrow night. Good to may I please? Have some sumac? Sure. <laughs> you know, sumac, we grow in sumac now. You're growing it? Yes. Really? In wow. Oh, wow. Yes. That is called fresh. And some kamun, please. Kamun. <laughs> <laughs> Oregano. 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 So we're getting all these beautiful spices to marinate our meats in because we're doing some delicious marinated slow cooked lamb and some Greek star barbecue lamb. Yum. And you've got to have oregano for the Greek star lamb. Yeah. I just want to be eating it. <laughs> Let's fast forward to when we eat it. <laughs> Fantastic. But look at all these beautiful spices and herbs. Look at the colours of these paprikas are amazing and chilli. It's just a heaven over here. I think the green sky pesto is my favourite. It's beautiful. Mm. And the, the, how do you pronounce it? Verte? Vert? Uh, so I'm, just, I'm just about to try a Moroccan pesto paste. Yeah, you'll like that one. He's got a much... That is so good. Yeah, his, his oh palate God. endures heat way better than I do. I That's not even know. spicy to me. <laughs> it is, a little bit. <laughs> oh, yummy. Yeah, that's beautiful. Thank you. A little the, bit of kick? Yeah, the, the kick as well, but it's like, oh, it's just the same. Thing. Green Sky Organics at Rockley Market. Thank you. All right, let's go grab some veggies. You know, one of the things I love about coming to this market is all the storeholders who are just so helpful and so lovely. You can ask them anything and you can get any, even when it's super busy. Hey, Michelle. <laughs> even when it's super busy, there's a friend of mine just there. When it's super busy, they will pause and give you as much help as they need, as you need, which love. It's such a great market. Great, because you guys will know where David Jones' seafood is. Yeah, he's, he's 
in that corner. Right at the first corner. To yeah, come in. yeah. Fantastic. Oh my god, everything is so beautiful here. Yeah. Check out this time. It's just like so fresh. It's so delicious. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Yum. We're going to put these in salads and in drinks. And you can never have too much mint. Yum. Look at this beautiful bunch. And they sprayed it with water so it looks extra cool. <laughs> I love dill. Yeah. Uh, we need some fennel. Yep. It's a real art. Yeah. Yeah. Trying to figure out how, how much yeah. people will eat. Yeah, yeah. Trying to do the calculations of, well, if one person eats and then doing the multiplications and, yeah. and having enough but not too much. And yeah, it is an art. The smaller the cucumber, the sweeter. Yeah. And also, different varieties have different bitterness levels in the skin. So the Lebanese cucumbers and the baby cucumbers have almost no bitterness in the skin. So, you know, when you, when you pick a cucumber, you should just feel the, that it's like firm and not bendy. When it gets bendy, it's sort of dehydrating and a bit old. Oh my God. <laughs> Get in my mouth. Well, it's... <laughs> <laughs> Um, well, I'm just using it like for normal garlic, but, but I just find that it's so much stronger when it's smoked, so it's no, just right. more robust. Smoky flavour. No, it doesn't, but it somehow makes it more intense, the right. garlic, so I just like to buy it anyway. Yeah, cool. <laughs> makes the cupboard smell really good. <laughs> now in season. We love this stall. One, the produce is always so fresh. So well priced, always in season, and really well cared for. You don't get seconds here, never seconds. And on top of that, these guys are so friendly and so lovely. They make the whole experience fantastic. <laughs> so you. all our friends come here. <laughs> and Liam's the most handsome grocer in the whole world. Right, oh. right. Should be modelling, not working. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. You get, you get a broccolini for that. <laughs> Dinner. Free stuff. <laughs> it's going to taste better. <laughs> we are doing a, a wraps dinner party. It's so called Wrap Around the World. Wrap Around the World. We've got like Cajun flavoured lamb, yeah. Indian flavoured fish, Middle Eastern lamb, and Greek flavoured something and and just doing all different fillings and sauces and unreal yummy wraps and it's gonna be pretty awesome man sounds yeah. good yeah time's dinner. <laughs> <laughs> man i'm just in so much appreciation of this place uh this store in particular and the spice guy it's just like the produce here is it's really exciting actually you see it you smell it you touch it it feels fresh, it feels supportive for your body, and it's actually just so much fun getting all of these ingredients for this awesome dinner that we're gonna have, and we're with these people, and we're, we're out in the community as well. It, it's, just, it's just special. Take care, see you next time. Thanks, brother. Thanks, man. <laughs> see you later. We're a little devastated because we found out that our fish man, Davey Seafood, is not here today. Yeah, I mean, this guy's fish is on the next level. I don't think I can go below it, <laughs> but I need salmon. <laughs> Damn it. Let's find some flowers. So our color is peachy. No particular reason, it's just really pretty. So we're just gonna get some pretty flowers to put on the table to make, set the scene. Everything's so pretty. <laughs> I love these pom-pom flowers. I like that one. That one, it's really cute, isn't it? Nice. Nice. And so now we just need some greens to put around it. Yeah, like... A bit of contrast? Yeah. I think we've got everything now. Yeah, I mean, it sure is filled up. 
and it looks amazing. Everything looks so good. Love this place. So by now you'll probably realise that it is so important to the quality of your cooking to have the quality of the ingredients. So important. And I've spoken about it previously in other videos, but you know, your, your final product is only ever going to be as good as one, how good you are in terms of, you know, the quality that you cook in, but two, equally the quality of the produce you buy, uh, whether it's in season, how fresh it is. It's not ba about being snobby about products, it's just sourcing them when they're fresh, vibrant, yeah. still full of life, um, and well, well handled and cared for. Yeah. Mm. Let's go make some food. <laughs> I'd love to <laughs> Something about these spices that make me just We're very happy when we come here. I know. Oh. Will you marry me? <laughs> now that's that's natural, you know. You don't get twins, just so you know. <laughs>